Hello everyone. Welcome to the video session on topographical survey sheets. I am Onushua. I teach geography for ICC, IGCSC and CBSC grade 6 to 10 standard. The objective of this video is to feminize the students with survey sheets. So let's begin the topic. The question is that what is meant by topographical survey sheets and what is the uses of topographical survey sheets. It is very very interesting to know that the first topographical survey sheet was made by Major General William Roy in Britain in 1765. In India, Survey of India established by British in 1767. Major James Rangel was the first Survey General of India. So, Survey of India established by British in 1767 and Major James Rangel Renal, the first survey general of India. This information we need to know. Now the next question is, then what is the uses of topographical survey sheets? These survey sheets are useful for army, town planners, tourist department, industrialized and students. The survey sheet mostly used by army to locate the places using latitude and longitude. They are useful for town planner because they have to plan the project according to topographical survey sheets. Then they will know about the transport roads using topographical survey sheets. This map is also useful for tourist department for tourist department is used survey sheets to set the layout of the city. But the most interesting thing is that on tourist maps, these maps are not drawn to according to scale. This map is also useful for industrialized. But this map is more important for students as it is part of the ICC board exam. The topo sheets are used by geographers and students to do their research and project. And for board exam, this map will come for 20 marks, which is very, very important. Okay. Next is, then we need to know what is topographical map. A topographical map is a detailed and accurate illustration of man-made and natural features on the ground such as roads, railways, contours, elevation, rivers, lakes, etc. So, we can say that a topographical map is a detailed and accurate description of the man-made and natural features. So, man-made features, it can be roads, railways, which is created by men and natural features, which is contours, elevation, rivers, etc., which is created naturally. A topographical map associated with legend, that is index, Number two is scale and number three is north arrow. So without direction, we cannot, cannot find out any location or any features. There are two maps for ICC board exam that is 45D by 7 and 45D by 10. So from these two maps, any one map will come for board exam. Identification of survey sheet or marginal information. So, these are the basic information what we need to know before start the chapter. 
number 45 d by 7 and d by 10 what I have already explained are if that is 1 is to 50,000 1 is to 50,000 that is a scale so scale 2 centimeter equal to 1 kilometer that is 2 centimeter on the map which represent 1 kilometer on the ground areas parts of Gujarat and Rajasthan so from this two places any states they will provide easting and nording so this vertical line that is easting and horizontal line that is nording easting are numbered from west to east and nording from south towards the north so that is easting and nording next is network of easting and nording so network means this vertical and horizontal line they are together creating grid lines so network of easting and nording that is grid contour height are given in meter so here we can see some brown color line and that is given in meter which indicates the height of that contour line then yellow color areas shows cultivable land which means this areas which is yellow in color this areas is suitable for agriculture or this is agricultural land sand features are depicted in brown so on topographical map sand features will be depicted by brown color the areas get scant rainfall as all the rivers are ponds are dry so here we can see some dry streams also or rivers so here because of lack of river or lack of rainfall it, it becomes dry okay but we have some type of map in that particular map you will get to understand easily the number k is denotes what next is the occupation of people is cultivation so here we can see yellow color so agricultural activities has done here so we can say that the occupation of people is cultivation okay so this is the topographical map hope you all understood the concept so i will meet in next video thank you so much